everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be planning in my mini happy planner for the week of Christmas, which is the 23rd through the 29th. And I'm going to be using stickers from the Happy Year sticker book. I have been so excited to use these, <laughs> the Santa riding the llama that I just can't even <sighs> explain it. I love it. <laughs> I love it so much. So anyway, we're going to be using stickers from Happy Year. I pulled one sticker from the Colorful Boxes sticker book, and it doesn't really quite match uh, the green and the spread, so I don't know if I'm going to use it. So let me go ahead and take the pages off of the disc, and we'll get started. Okay, so I'm going to cover up uh, the two major little areas here, um, this one and this one. So I've already cut a piece of label paper down to size. Actually, it's a little bit shorter than what it should be, but that's okay. It's not that big of a deal because I'm gonna put a sticker on it mostly. So um, I left this side of it showing a little bit of a gap with the color because I'm gonna put this winter bucket list sticker down it. Just like that. It's a little bit crooked, but uh. Actually, and it's a little bit wrinkled up at the top here. So let me fix that. All right, that needs to go somewhere. Like, I don't know what I'm gonna do with that now. Okay, and then we're gonna cover up this Christmas tree down here. You can still see a little bit of the color from that. And I think it's gonna be okay because I'm gonna put this Christmas tree down here and I'll just, um, yeah, it'll be fine. I'm going to put this present down here as well. I'm going to trim out around this tree for the present because um, I don't want it to look like it's overlapping. All right, just like that. So it kind of looks like it's sitting more behind the tree. Okay, so I need to find a place to put Santa and his llama. So I think I'm going to put him up here, like right in here. And I'm going to have to white out all this stuff right here. It's Christmas week and there's not like a whole lot going on. So I'm not really like super concerned about space. I really wanted to find a way to cover that up, but I'm not sure how I want to do it. I think I might do it with another one of these, uh, another one of these gifts. Yeah. So let me white out this. And then I'm going to kind of angle it a little bit so that it will cover up all the white out. And then I'm just going to trim it down the box there. All right, let's move over to this side for just a minute. I want another llama on this side. So I want one that's facing to the left. And I could, had kind of hoped to be able to use like one of the larger ones, but it looks like I'm gonna have to do the small one. Like that. Okay, so for Christmas, I want to do this, uh, let's see, this colorful box. So if I do a green one here, and then, all right, we're gonna go with it. I'm gonna put this green box here for Christmas. And then the Santa is gonna go on this box as well. I need to white out underneath this box. All right, I put a little bit too much white out on there, so I'm gonna try to scrape it off just a touch. And that looks like it's gonna work. So I should probably just cut this piece of the sticker out. I think that would be a whole lot easier. Okay, that will work. <clears throat> then I'm just gonna put this Christmas sticker in here. And then we have Christmas Eve. So I think I want to do a red sticker there. So let me grab one out of the book here if I have one. And yes, I do. So I'm going to put it down a little bit lower. 
because I mean I really can't help that they're like directly next to each other so and then I'll put the Christmas Eve sticker in here like that and I really kind of would like something to go next to it so let's take this little bird and get it up off the wax paper goodness like that okay so i think i want to dress up the christmas one just a little bit and we'll put like a little sprig of this holly next to that and we'll do the uh, other christmas tree on this side i kind of wish there was some <clears throat> like cute washi or something Okay, let's use this. I'm gonna stick this tree down for just a second. And I'm gonna try to put this over here. Alrighty. And then we'll do this other Christmas tree up here. Okay, so what else now? Let's do this red one down here with the llama. Put that there. And use the other piece like up here in the corner on Monday. Oh no, I don't like it. It's too close to the to the one on Wednesday. Put it right there. So I think that we're probably gonna be done. And like I said, you know, it's a very, it's a very simple week this week and not a lot going on. So yeah, I think that's going to do it. I do need to trim out some of the punches here. So let me do that and I will be right back. Okay. So here we are back on the disc and I found these strings of lights and this, I think this is a teacher uh, seasonal book. But anyway, these strings of lights were in here. So I just added them in a couple of different places just to add a little bit more interest to this side. So there we go. That is my Christmas spread and for the week of Christmas and my mini happy planner. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider giving me a thumbs up and also subscribing to my channel if you haven't already. Thanks so much and I will see you in my next video.